How are you? Oh, I'm fine. You? I'm fine. Wildlife's pretty wild, isn't it? <laughs> Between the noise and the lights, you can hardly hear yourself think, much less talk. Yeah, well, it normally isn't your kind of place, is it? Um, sometimes. It depends on my mood. Help you, sir. Uh, ah, yeah, uh, give me a dark beer, please. Okay. Would you like another wine? Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? Thanks. <laughs> Why do I get the impression you're not too happy about me seeing you here? I can't imagine. Well, why did you get such an impression? <laughs> well, maybe it's because of the way you turned around when you saw me. Oh, that's just your policeman's paranoia. Uh, and even though it may look to you like he's just a glorified bouncer, there's a lot more to the job than that. He's learning the ropes of managing a club. Oh, he's going into business for himself, is he? Well, you didn't expect him to stay here forever, did you? Oh, no, one way or the other. <laughs> oh, well, he's not going to be here very long. He'll probably go on to buy a place of his own or go into broadcasting or something. Well, I guess I'd better get going. Got another stop to make. Oh. Check on a mugging. Well, I hope the mugger doesn't turn out to be one of my clients. <laughs> <laughs> Take care of yourself. Yes, you too. Pleasure of seeing you here. Yeah. I also ran into your daughter a little earlier, by accident. Yeah, where was that? At the wildlife. Yeah, we had a little chance to talk a little bit. I hate to be asking you this, but Ed, I am worried. Well, we're still friends. If uh, she wants to use the friendship, I'll do what I can. Uh, hey, are uh, you leaving? Uh, I already stayed longer than I wanted to. Oh, wait a minute. No, honey, I feel even more strongly that this is all wrong for you. Oh, uh, or maybe seeing Ed Hall brought back memories of the old days and what a man he was, huh? Oh, come on, Ed had nothing to do with it. Except as I felt compelled to defend you and this job, which meant I was lying. Now, why would you want to go and do a thing like that unless his opinion is all that important? Would you prefer that I cry on the shoulder? Has it ever occurred to you that uh, you're more upset about my the job I took than the one I lost? Huh? That's not true. Oh, yes, it is. I felt awful for you. I tried to cover it up because I was trying to pick up your spirits, but I felt miserable for you. Oh, and now you feel miserable for yourself. I mean, Carla Scott doesn't go with managers of nightclubs. I mean, she goes with heart surgeons and police captains and star running backs, right? Um, I, I, I think we better continue this at home, preferably tomorrow. I mean, I really cannot deal with this right now. Incidentally, I, I probably won't be up when you come home. Yeah, of course you won't. If you're asleep, you don't have to make love, do you? I fire last time. Oh, boy. 